Hey y'all, it's uh, Justin from CartoonSmart.com and I think the internet needs an update on how to connect two uh, microphones uh, for podcasting if you're going to be using GarageBand. So let's go ahead and uh, we'll kind of start from scratch here. I'm going to hit the, uh, the command key on the Mac uh, followed by the space bar and let's look for the audio MIDI setup. It's in your utilities folder, but the quickest way to get there is just to do exactly what I just did. And uh, what we're going to do here is make a, a new audio device. So go over here to um, the plus sign, create aggregate device. And uh, you can name this something that makes a little bit more sense. So for example, just two mics, that would do it. Uh, all right. Uh, then we want to look for our two microphones. For some reason, my Yeti is listed in here twice. Uh, hopefully that doesn't matter too much. And then we'll grab this other uh, blue snowball over here. And I believe I clicked on built-in output last time. Okay. But uh, drift correction, I don't know if you, uh, no clue of whether or not you want that on. <laughs> but uh, why not? Let's throw it in there. Uh, we can always go back and change it. All right. So once you've done that, uh, quit out of there. Okay. Uh, let's just, I'm going to hit don't use for right now. And then I'm just going to start a new project. Um, in fact, I won't even save that. Okay. Uh, let's go with uh, empty projects. We'll choose this. Okay. Now, over here to input one and two. Okay. Uh, click this little button. All right. And you're going to go find your two mics. Okay. Turn off notifications. And close that. All right. Uh, I hear from a sound from built-in output. Uh, one of the tutorials I followed before for this um, had this checked off. I kind of found that that was sort of annoying. I had to plug uh, the headphones in to deal with kind of the feedback at that point. So I just recommend that you don't check that off. Uh, hit create. All right, so this is gonna be our first channel over here. And I'm currently I'm tapping on the second um, the Yeti is kind of my preferred one. I'm tapping on the second one right now. It's really not giving me any feedback. If I but if I tap on this one, oh, it should be clear that yeah, you're seeing a little bump, and you probably heard that too. Uh, so we've got that channel I guess set up. <laughs> Let's go then and uh, click on the plus over here, uh, and then we're gonna put in input three, and uh, you can also leave this as connected with two mics. Okay, so go ahead and create that, and. Okay, I just tapped on the my kind of secondary mic over here. All right, so that's still going. Uh, but what you're not seeing is this one has now kind of been deactivated, right? Uh, well, just selecting it, I guess, kind of reactivate that. Um, uh, so now what we want to do is hold down the shift key and then uh, click on both of those. All right, and actually, you know what? I think we need to do one more step. Go over here to track, configure track header. Okay, yeah, record enable. There we go. All right, and let's do that over here as well. Might not need to, but let's find out. Okay, so it's got record enable. And uh, all right, so I think I had the wrong thing pressed before. Don't worry about those. Uh, but now we want to hold down shift and be sure you do it. So hold down shift again, do it on both of these. And what you want to see is that both of these are flashing like that before you go over here and start recording anything. Uh, and then all right, so now I'm going to start recording. Don't really need the metronome going, do we? Let's stop that. All right, so I'll start it again. And all right, so I'm talking into basically this microphone right now. Now I'll go talk into this one. Okay, so not sure how that sounded on the screen capture. Uh, but uh, there you have it. Uh, so this is kind of a note to myself because it seems like I have to set this back up every time I do it. Uh, but uh, there you go, the 2018 edition with the most, whatever recent version of GarageBand this is. You know what? Let's go over here. About GarageBand 10.2. Okay, so there you have it.